today we will learn capital letter L. First, I will show how to write on the whiteboard. First, a standing line. Left, sorry, right of the standing line. We have to write one sleeping line. Finish. Hello kids. Today we will learn the capital letter L. So what we have to learn how to trace some words with L. Okay and a picture. Now trace letter capital letter L. If you see the picture the number 1 is showing the standing line. At the end of the standing line number 2 is the sleeping line. Right. Now I will show. So just observe. First what we have to write? A standing line. At the end point of the standing line we have to write sleeping line to the right side. Okay. It's very simple right? Standing line. Right side to it a sleeping line. Now yes. See this here. Observe how it is writing. Right. Standing on the sleeping line. Shall we see it again? Standing line and sleeping line. Very nice. Now we will see how to write in the where four grid lines so first three lines we have to write the standing line at the third line that means second blue line we have to write the sleeping line all capital letters we have to write only in the first three lines standing line and the first three lines and the sleeping line at the third line okay so like this we have to write in the English notebook. Now we'll see a few words with the letter L. The first one L for lion. You know this very well. L for lion. So it's a wild animal right. And it is the king of the jungle. You know that right. It is the king of the jungle. Yes. And it's very cruel. It's very L for Lady finger. L for lady finger. It's known as okra. It's a tall plant whose pots are eaten as a vegetable. It's a vegetable, you know, right? Yes. L for lamb. So, what is the difference between sheep and the lamb? The baby sheep is called the lamb. It's very cute, right? Even there is one rhyme. We had a little lamb. Yes. L for ladle. Ladle is a large and deep spoon with a long handle that is used for serving a liquid. So, in our houses it will be there, right? To pour liquids like sambar like that. L for lemon. Lemon is a bright yellow citrus fruit that has sour taste. What is the taste of it? It's sour. It's not sweet or something like that, right? You know this lemon. L for lemon. The next one. L for ladder. It's a structure for climbing up or down that has two long pieces of wood with a series of steps between them. Right? If you go to the high, like height, we will use the ladder. L for lamp. Lamp is a device that produces light as by electricity, oil or gas. It may be bed lamp or any other lamp. Yes? L for laptop. It's a portable personal computer that can work with a battery. Okay. So all CPU and desk, uh, like um, screen everything will be in the one device. Right. That is called laptop. The next one is L for ladybug. L for ladybug. It's an insect. Small flying insect. Okay. L for lettuce. Lettuce is used in the salads, mostly in the salads. It's a difference from coriander. Coriander is different, lettuce is different. 
so many people will get confused between these two right okay now we'll see some activities circle the letter l capital letter l. these are all the capital letters you have to circle only letter l first one is it l yes circle l circle the next one is c the next one f what's the next one a this one l so circle h l circle and the last one is j you all know these letters right good the next one is circle the pictures start with l so these are few pictures the first one what is that l for just now we discussed lamp right so we have to circle or not yes we have to circle l for lamp the next one l for lion so circle this one umbrella umbrella won't start with l right so we should not circle the next one is duck it's also not with l ball not with l what is the next one that is leaf right what will be there on the trees leaves right yes l for leaf what's yeah draw l for lamp oh with capital letter l we'll see how to draw the lamp it's very easy observe and you can write later okay so first what we have to write we have to write the capital letter l below it again write another capital letter l so we have to draw a sleeping lines like this and join here and the standing line again again it's very very easy okay so this will be like a stand so above that we have to draw the lamp so only standing and sleeping lines okay and there will be small slanting line left side and right side and we have to close it with a sleeping line see so we have to design the slamp right if you want you can design you can color it with your favorite color okay just i am drawing circles for the design okay so see how simple the lamp we drawn with capital letter L. This is the wire. There will be wire, right? To plug. Some lamps with work with battery. For that there will be no lamp. No wire. Okay. So this is the case for drawing of the lamp. It's very easy, right? So you have to practice. What you have to practice? You have to practice the capital letter L tracing the words and the picture. How to draw the lamp. And color it neatly. Okay. Okay kids. Bye bye.